everyone, I'm Alex Cosford. I'm Senior Program Facilitator at the Midland Early On Child and Family Center. And this is our eighth video in our Fun Kids Activities video series. Today, we're gonna to look at the science and variety of pine cones. I have a whole bunch here for us to look at. So these wee little tiny ones, And we also have some slightly larger ones. And they're round, a long, larger kind, and then these giant pine cone. These ones are from the West Coast. All the others were from my front yard. Now all of these are dry the petals have all opened up, and that's where a seed had lived inside each petal of the pine cone. When they're dry, they open up. But when they're wet, they close up. It's part of the magic of pine cones. Now, these small round ones are from the red pine tree. They grow tall all across Canada. You can see they have the rounder, smaller pine cone. These longer ones, the larger, longer pine cone, that comes from a white pine tree, the western white pine, similar to red, but they have a different constellation of needles. There's gonna be five needles per bunch, and they have those longer cones. These wee ones, these tiny ones from my front yard, they're from a hemlock tree, not a pine tree, a western hemlock. They don't have the same kinds of needles. They have the smaller needles and the wee little pine cones, different than a pine tree. And then these large ones from the west coast, they're from a giant sequoia. And when I say giant, I mean giant. Can you see that? That's a regular size cabin. And that is a huge giant sequoia. And that's why their pine cones are so much bigger. And look at that, when they open up, they're just beautiful, large, huge pine cones. And there are so many different things that you can do with pine cones. So today I could have counted them, I could have sorted them, I could have matched them, find ones that are closest in color and size. These guys are almost twins. You can paint them or glue them. Like some of these, this has a bit of gold paint on it. You can put glue and glitter and gild it up. This one has some gold sparkles on it and some copper paint. You can put wire on them and attach them to other things. You can make decorations out of them to hang in windows or to put on holiday trees. You can make pretend figurines. You can cover them with peanut butter and bird seed and hang them from trees and they make amazing bird feeders. Or you could make a fun outdoor scene with some glue and a Kleenex box and you have your own little magic forest kingdom for the animals. Maybe some of your toys wanna to play in there. Awesome, that was a lot of fun talking about all different types of pine cones, where the seeds come from, how you can use them to keep the kids busy, keep yourself busy um, during this time. That's it for this video. Be sure to watch next week. Vid uh, Margaret's gonna share some fun flashlight fun um, going on a night walk. Thanks, bye.